All right, so what's up, everybody? I know it's been a long time since I posted. I've had schoolwork and all that stuff. And I did get an internship, so it wasn't a whole waste of time. All right, so by the title of the video, you guys already know what we're making today. The Black Panther helmet. All right, RP Chadwick, too. So since I don't have any leftover vibranium, I'm like, you know, I am going to be using some carbon fiber PLA with it. And another good thing is I did get a new printer, the Ender 3, with, which has a heated bed and a much bigger bed. So I won't have to worry about warping and I can print much faster. So let's get started. But before that, like, comment, and subscribe. And tell me what you guys want me to build next. Okay, so we're going to start by going to Thingiverse and searching up and looking for a Black Panther helmet. In got the Killmonger one, this one, alright, so this one looks good, and it already comes divided, which is great, so, I'm gonna download these files, load them up in Cura, and start printing them out. Alright, so I have the part loaded up in Cura. I'm about to center it and get it to start printing. All right, okay. slice that. Okay, so after about 10 minutes of slicing, got the print ready, and I'm gonna send it to the printer to start printing. Okay. Okay, so after about eight hours, or like eight hours and 49 seconds, just crazy. Got part of the head done finally. Got all the support structures and stuff. So I'm gonna take this off. I'm gonna go into the other parts. I'm still not done with the printing. I got a few other parts I gotta print out and yeah, I'm gonna test and see how this works. All right, so just got the parts glued together. Now we're basically, I'd say 40% done. The cool part about using hot glue for this is if I'm to shine a light through it, uh, you can see the light comes through, which is kind of my goal using the LEDs and everything. So it'll be able to light up the purple so I can get that Black Panther uh, kinetic energy thing. So yeah, I'm gonna figure out how to use that. Now, these two bottom parts took about like six, five hours to print individually. This big one took about eight hours. So I'm going to have to do another eight hour print tomorrow for this side. Then the back right here with the ears and everything. Those are supposed to be 12 hour prints each. Which I don't know how I'm going to go about doing because I got an exam tomorrow. My PlayStation literally just came in. It's not the best combination for like getting work done, but we gonna get this done. All right, so let's go. Okay, so right now, I'm just making holes in the helmet. As you can see, I got some right here, got some right here, and I got some right here. Just so that when I shine the LED lights through, it would get like more of a surface area of light coming through the helmet. All right, so to do this, I'm using my solder. Obviously, I don't recommend you guys doing this because it causes a lot of fumes and everything, and I don't think it's healthy for you. So, let's see. Okay, so now I got all the LEDs working and all the Arduinos working in there. So you notice if I put the LEDs right behind the helmet, the all the light seeps through. So it gives that purple accent in the helmet. And that's kind of what I'm going for right now. So now I'm gonna finish up the helmet and see how it works. So now this right here is the finished helmet. I got it all glued together. I got all the electronics glued on the inside right now. Batteries, everything fits perfectly. I got a button on the outside so I can turn on and off the LEDs when I need to. And yeah, and I noticed when I was putting this on, I need a do-rag or else my hair will get caught in all the wires and in the fibers of the helmet. So yeah, for now, gotta wear the blue rag. All right, so let's test this out. So 
that's the helmet you got. So as you can see, that's a pretty cool helmet. And props to the guy who designed it. I'm going to tag him on the bottom of the video. So first things first, I'm probably never going to take this thing off. It's, it's just too cool. I got the LEDs. I can turn them on and off from the button right here. And yeah, that's all I really need. So like, comment, subscribe. Tell me what you guys want me to build next. You want, I'm thinking either the Iron Man helmet or the Mandalorian helmet. Not sure which one I want yet, so you guys tell me. Alright, so like, comment, subscribe. Follow me on Instagram. And yeah, kind of forever. Peace out.